Hi everyone! My name is Amanda and everyone seems to be doing these summer reading plans videos so I thought why not just do it? I have watched loads of these videos and I just find them really really inspirational and really fun to watch so I thought why not just share with you guys what I'm planning on reading and doing this summer. Well, for me it isn't summer quite yet. The last day of school is June 13th, which is so close to now and I just can't wait. I'm so excited to just be done with this. I feel so done for this semester. Did you guys know that semester means holiday in Swedish? Yeah. But anyway, the day after school's over, me and my family are actually going to Croatia for two weeks. Do not worry, there will be videos for you to enjoy during those two weeks. I will make sure of that. But on to my plans, shall we? I haven't quite decided what books I will bring to Croatia, but I have the plans of making an entire separate video about my Croatia TBR. So you can expect that in a couple of weeks. But one thing I know for sure is that I will continue on with the Game of Thrones series. And I actually started A Clash of Kings yesterday and I've already read a hundred pages. So I'm actually quite optimistic about this one. And I do really love the series and I'll show them to you. Hold on. So I've already read A Game of Thrones, but the second one is A Clash of Kings. The third one is A Storm of Swords. The fourth one is... A Feast for Crows and the fifth and not final one but the last one that has come out is A Dance with Dragons. And as you can see there are quite a lot of pages but I will at least get through a couple of them I hope because I really need to catch up. I am also planning on reading a bunch of contemporary books this summer because I've just been really lacking in that genre lately. I haven't read a contemporary book in ages and I mean contemporary isn't my favorite genre but I'm but once I start reading I do really enjoy the books so I really need to read some more contemporary. For me to be able to do so I have some readathons that I will be participating in. We have the booktube a thon which is in July and the bout of books 11.0 I think is in August sometime. I participated in the booktube a thon last year and I really enjoyed it so I'm just really really excited. But I just can't wait for summer to start and the weather is really nice outside now but we are just locked in school and I just can't wait to get outside and don't have to study and just have summertime and it's just a few weeks away now. So have you guys already gotten your summer holiday? If you have, just have a really great summer and if you haven't, when do you get it? I'm just really curious. So that was it for this video. I'm sorry for not making another video during the week that has been, but I have studied like a madman for my math exam, which I had two days ago. So now it's finally over. I'm not really a big fan of math, to be honest. But if you enjoyed it, please give it a big thumbs up because that would help me out a lot. Do not forget to subscribe and I will see all of you guys in my next video, so stay tuned. Bye!